Greetings everyone. This video I'm going to talk about how to escape your script and start writing your own. Greetings. This infinite source truth is made possible by the generous contributions and support of viewers like you. Please consider making a contribution now. Thank you. This video is going to start with the basics, the must haves in place. Okay, so there is one thing that you have to have accomplished before you will be able to rewrite any of your script or to escape your current script. And that is you must have stopped eating all animal, meat, flesh, blood, fish, and anything with a heart. You will not be able to escape your script and start writing your own script without having done that for at least 30 days with the intent of continuing to not eat the animals. This is required to raise your frequency enough that you can escape your script and start writing your own. Now, there are things that will benefit you, although they're not necessary, would be the three self-hypnosis videos that I have on this channel, and I'll put a link um, right here for you to go through. Now, there is a video explaining those self-hypnosis videos, so I'm not going to go through it again here, but you will benefit from going through those videos. It will make the process easier and faster for you to accomplish. If you choose to not do it, then it will just take you longer to accomplish uh, the script rewriting. Now, you know that you have a script that you are not enjoying and you want out of that script and you want to create a script and rewrite your script. How do you do that? Well. First of all, you need to take out a piece of paper and it's going to require some thought on your part. Because when you rewrite your script, you are still working with your personality and your emotions and what you like and what you don't like. So let's make a sheet of paper. Let's start first of all. What are your strengths? Examine what your strengths are what your talents are, what your abilities are. Now, somewhere in this list of make it three lists, your strengths, your talents, and your abilities. What usually happens is that unless you know how to rewrite your script, you get caught in a fog and a haze because you really don't know where to start. And where you need to start is what your talents are. What would you like to experience? Is there some talent or ability that you would like to learn that you don't currently possess? All of these things are things that you can write into your new script. For instance, I want to learn how to do computer motion graphics and to have the software to be able to accomplish it and to learn it. Okay, so you would put down on your script for visualization the money coming to you for that class the provision coming to you for that software, the provision coming to you of time to spend to learn these new things that you want to learn. Perhaps you want to learn how to do oil painting or how to do electronics or how to do architecture Whatever it is that's inside of you that says, you know, I would really kind of like to and enjoy it if I could learn more about that, then you put those things down. 
Now, because they're there today does not mean that they're going to be there in a month or even two months. Because right now you're just trying to work at escaping the script that you currently have. You're going to go by those talents and abilities and desires that are deeply hidden and tucked away within you. And you're going to build on them. But it doesn't mean that that's going to be the direction that you will eventually take. But it's a starting place. Get out that piece of paper and make your list. And put down the things that you enjoy, what you enjoy right now. What are the things that you are doing that you are involved with in your life right now that you enjoy? Because all of these things are going to direct you to a way of benefiting other source players with your talents and abilities and knowledge. And it's going to create a way for you to have your desires and needs met. You need to be doing something. It's not beneficial for you to simply stay closed up without a flow. You see, to grow in this, you need to have a flow going through you. If you stop it all up and there isn't a flow going into you and then spilling over and going out of you, into other source players, a flow going out of you, then you're full and you have no room for more. And when that starts happening, you start to stagnate and that is not where you want to be as a source player. You want to keep the flow going. It is very important. The higher your frequency rises, the easier you will find it to be to come up with the creative ideas and to uh, manifest those things that you want in your script. And the easier it will be for you to benefit other people because as your frequency rises, more source knowledge is imparted to you as the powerful source player that you are and creator that you are. Right now, most source players are still eating meat and they're still experiencing their scripts the way they were written. And it's very simple to get out of and escape those scripts. But it's going to take a commitment and work on your part. So right now, you need to get out that sheet of paper, and before you progress to the next video, you need to have a list of what your personality is, what you like, what, if you could envision your dream job, what would it be? What would you be doing in that dream job? What talents and skills and abilities would you be using in that dream job? What skills do you need to learn or to improve in order to get yourself to the level of that dream job? This is you being creative. This is you experiencing the life that you would like to experience. I'm going to end this video here and give you some time to make your lists and give some thoughts to this. Again, your personality really plays into this because your personality is something that will not be changed. It is part of your uh, birth contract and your script. And it is nearly impossible to change your personality type. However, you can become more open if you are a very introverted type of person. It is possible to, to reverse that. But at the very depth of your being, your personality is sort of with you always. And it is probably the most difficult thing for you to change. Not impossible, but very difficult. So you need to take all of these things into consideration. You know, is a job on the computer something? Is a job working with other people something? 
you know, are you envisioning your own business? Would you like to be a creator of websites, uh, which you could do anywhere in the world? There are many, many things. Do you want to travel? You know, what types of things can you come up with? You know, you love photography. You would love to be make a living off of traveling and photography. All of these things are possible. You have to know it and you have to be able to envision yourself in those positions. And we're going to talk about how you start to shift your script into the one that you write instead of the one that's been given to you in the next video. So get busy, write that list, give some thought, some real thought to what you enjoy and what you would consider your dream job to be. So now is everything that I have shared in this video about uh, changing their life scripts, infinite source, truth only, and not what I think or believe. And that is a yes for my program pendulum. So you verify it for yourself. And I would even say your lists of things about the things that you enjoy. Do you know that your infinite source self knows you better than you know yourself? And like I said, your list may start out one way today. And as you start to escape the script that you are in, you will discover new things that you enjoy. And those pre-programmed thoughts, your previous script will start dissolving and your thoughts will start becoming your own. And you may discover some things about yourself and things that you like and would like to learn more than you thought before or right now. So abundance, health, and prosperity to you. Multiplication and increase also. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share this video. If you found this life changing, please consider giving a contribution and consider supporting monthly or giving a single gift via PayPal. Links are in the description box below. And be sure to check out these links for guided self-hypnosis meditations.